Welcome back to June Harvey's kennel. Uh, that is Clash with uh, Matthew here and uh, June Harvey alongside me as well. He's such a happy dog, as all of yours are, June. But when I met him at, at Paul recently, I was really taken with how sweet he is as well. What's he like in the kennel? Oh, well, he's brilliant in the kennel. You know, he, you don't know you've got him, really. He eats up, he, he's clean. He's just a lovely dog. Good-looking boy as well, isn't he? Oh, they're all good-looking. <laughs> Every one of my dogs are good looking, so um, no, he, he's, he's a good dog, he's consistent, lovely natured and a good runner. He is a good runner indeed and uh, I think it's fair to say Matt that he, he scraped through the first round but he was in a very tough heat wasn't he, what did you make of his run? Yeah, no, he ran well, he, he boxed lovely, he was actually first uh, on the splits but um, you had the outside of the top four in the race and uh, yeah, he got barged off a little bit and obviously first bend at Toaster you could be sent quite wide. And it's, you know, it's only his uh, second look at the track with us anyway, so he's just going to get better the more looks he gets at the track. Do you think it suits him though? The distance suits him, 500. Um, yeah, but when you're up against Derby dogs, you know, you, you do need the, uh, you need the draw and you need the, the space to run, but he's not, he's not probably up there with the anti-post favourites, but he's, he's a very good dog, yeah. He's got an incredibly tough second round. King Elvis in trap one, Shane Boy Freddy inside him in trap three. He gets trap four. You've got Oi Oi U penalty in there. It's a really tough second round. Yeah, he won't be able to uh, have any mistakes, that's for sure. Um, at least the draw's better for us, uh, three railers. And he's, you know, he's got the inside of the middle seeds, if you like. So hopefully he can get another fast away break and leave him a clear run. We'll take the. He's uh, 114th and 35, June. Really good strike rate for you. Oh, brilliant. Yes, it's. Um... Well, as I say, he usually has early pace. He usually pings the lids and he's gone. And, uh, but uh, Toaster, he just doesn't seem to be hitting the lids. But um, no, he is. He's really good. He's, he's just a real genuine greyhound. Beautiful. Hopefully he can hit the lids in his second round uh, race because it's a tough one. Do you think he'll get through? I hope so. I really do hope so. He's well enough, he's good enough, and at the end of the day, it's just the luck of the draw. You know, if he can get a clear run, get his eyes on the bunny, then he'll, he'll qualify. He's a beautiful greyhound, really quite taken with Clash. There he is. That is uh, Clash who runs on Saturday night at Toaster.